in a second y'all been seeing my travel vlogs and stuff like that and that's all been pre-recorded but this is the first time i'm really vlogging out in public again and trying to ignore the looks and stares but yeah this morning i've had such a good morning y'all such a good morning i've been waking up at 6 30 a.m for the past three days y'all it's low-key been changing my life low-key but anyways um woke up at 6 30 a.m went to the gym walked my dog made some breakfast came out here so i could do some shopping i had some quick little errands to do i needed to go to the apple store bro i don't know what's going on but my apple products been playing with me just two weeks ago i was out here at the apple store because my beats stopped working and i had to send them to like i had to send them away to go get repaired and they sent me some new beats which i love but mm, i hate having to make the trip out here to the apple store and then I came here again today because my charger literally stopped working, y'all. Like, the charger to my laptop. Mind you, I've had this laptop for like maybe like four years now. <laughs> She's been really good to me, but like, this is the original charger that came with the laptop. And I don't know what happened, y'all, but it's like the cord just like fried. Like, first of all, why is it yellow? Okay. But also, like, it just like won't as you can see it won't go in all the way and i think it's because something is wrong internally so anyways um as you guys can see i picked up some new gear and this is now my new charger block i just dropped a bag at apple i'm not gonna lie <laughs> i'm not gonna lie then i went to walgreens and i picked up some hair care um i'll show y'all that when i get home and then last stop is here i made it to one of my favorite cafes here in boston um press cafe right now i'm working on a video doing some heavy editing y'all i'm working on this vermont vlog make sure you guys go watch that because by the time you guys watch this vermont is already up so go watch that after you're done watching this video also have to film today maybe i'll film a little behind the scenes of my actual filming process i'm like really new to being consistent again on youtube so i'm like trying to find that like natural rhythm back again um really i'm fighting for my life because i'm supposed to upload tomorrow and i haven't even filmed yet but um yeah so after i finish doing some editing i'm probably gonna stay here for maybe like an hour and then i'm gonna head home and get to filming that video so i'm literally gonna film and edit in one day pray for me but that video is already up too so make sure y'all go watch that like y'all just got a lot to watch so go go do that after let me get back to this editing though y'all and i will talk to you later Y'all, 
y'all, that whole process took me way too long. You don't even want to know what time it is. When I last talked to y'all, the sun was still out. I just don't know where the time went. I literally don't know where it went. I had to like clean up my room. Um, and then I had to like gather up my clothes because this is kind of like a collective haul. And I had to walk my dog. Like it was just giving too much to do. But we're finally done. Here's the hair. Honestly, she's seen better days, but this is just going to have to do. Um, regular makeup routine. And I'm about to get filming, y'all. Honestly, this is the first time, you guys, that I'm filming a haul. Or the first time I'm, like, really filming in my apartment. I've been here since September, so. Yeah, I'm still trying to figure out, like, what I want my setup to be. Like, where I even want to do this haul. I'm thinking this area right here. I'm probably going to move this box. It's, like, a desk that I'm going to build. I think I'm going to build that in this vlog, actually. So, stay tuned for that. But, yeah, I'm thinking, like, here, like, right in front of my closet doors. And I'm like, does that just look mad plain? Like, we going to try it out. Okay, I'm thinking right here. I think this is okay. I don't know how people film their haul videos where they're able to get like the whole floor and like full body. Like I want y'all to see everything. Ooh, I'm looking strong. A little workout got me toned. A little workout from this morning. <laughs> okay, what do we think? I don't want y'all to see my desk at all. Like I wanted to just give floor. But it's giving jump. Okay, I think we got the angle, y'all. I think we got it. Let's move this stuff up. Oh. Oh, oh my god. You guys, bro. Like, why is that happening right now? I literally can't even leave my room. <laughs> Hold on, y'all. Let me show y'all real quick. Like, please. I'm trapped. Honestly, though, I need a lock in, so I really shouldn't be leaving this room. Okay, I think this looks pretty good. Yeah, this gonna have to do. Hey, y'all. Um, I'm currently working on the video that I was just filming, which is the haul. We have that exported here. And honestly, guys, I think it's gonna be good. Obviously, this isn't really a great way to show you guys, but... I think it's good it's comfortable it's so cute like this gives museum pictures like i just put this together okay that's enough but anyways um honestly i think the haul was a success i haven't really started editing that much yet but i felt like the setup was pretty good i kind of was like messing up the angle a bit y'all like as i'm looking back i'm seeing like my bed is in it a little bit like that's irritating but it's not the worst, whatever. Honestly, haul videos are like so easy to edit though. They're like my favorite videos to film and my favorite videos to edit because they're just so easy and I love clothes. So yeah, it's nothing for me to get this up. I just got to lock in and get this up, but I guess we'll see tomorrow. I guess we'll see tomorrow. I actually have a brand deal coming up. Ooh, that's exciting. This bun, oh my God, don't. If you say anything, you anti-black. <laughs> no, cause why it look like that? Anyways, I have a brand deal coming up with a clothing brand. Nothing crazy, y'all. It's like a Shein. Actually, it's kind of a full circle moment. I'm not gonna lie because this was the first brand that ever collaborated with me ever on YouTube. Like when I was like 17 years old, maybe even 16. And it was dressin.com. And I'm collaborating with Justin again. They just asked me. I'm like, cool. But anyways, I need to respond back to them with what clothes I want. I need to like go through their site and like pick out what items I want. And the last thing I need to do is book a bus ticket. Now that sounds really random without any context. I'm going to New York in two weeks. It's my friend Faith's birthday. I'm going literally just for a day. I go on Saturday and I come back on Sunday. So yeah, and we haven't booked the hotel, like LOL. But yeah, it's 10.33. I've been so good at going to bed early. And I think that's been helping me wake up early these past couple days, like I was telling y'all. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to hit the gym. I'm gonna try to get some footage for y'all tomorrow cause I forgot today, but I'm gonna hit the gym and then I'm gonna go to church. And then I'm gonna get my nails done because look at these nails, y'all. 
They're barking, bro. So I'm going to go to my nail appointment after church. And then we're just going to see where the day takes us. I just consistently feel like I have things to do. Does anybody else feel that way? Like, I feel like the to-do list is never checked off. Like, there's always tasks to be done. This has been the longest regroup in history. Um, I think I'm going to conclude today's vlog right now. I'm just going to do a little work and then go to bed. But I will talk to y'all tomorrow. Morning, y'all. I'm officially ready for the gym. I've gotten dressed. Y'all will see my gym fit later. Every time though, I like try to wake up early and go to the gym. It's been three days now. Every day I'm like, damn, like where does the time go? Like, do I need to wake up earlier? Today I got out of bed. Like I set my alarm for like 6.45. I probably got up at like 6.56. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, like damn near seven o'clock. And it's eight o'clock. I'm like, what the heck happened? I should have been in a gym. But luckily there's a gym in my apartment complex. So it's literally footsteps away. But yeah, I'm like, where does the time go? Also, it's very hard for me to eat this early in the morning. Like I'm a huge breakfast girl, but like even this is too early for your girl. Like my stomach hasn't even woken up. And I know some people work out on an empty stomach, but personally it's giving exhaustion to me. Like I don't think I can do that. I don't think I want to do that. So I try to fuel up on a little bit. But we about to hit the gym right now. Just wanted to give y'all a quick debriefing, but we're on our way out. 8 a.m. It's very rainy and gray and gloomy out, but let's get this work on it. And I'm feeling something very light today, though. from all the
overdose fun Before the double R had to hitchhike thumb Her friends didn't like dudes like us But I arrested the coochie and the fellas got cuffed Spiderweb sex must have got caught up But there's more to it I remember once Saying let's on the PRs Let's go to Vegas and watch Celine Dion Make them say what we are You say no like you was doing it for eons Fuck it, I just hum and let the watch give off the neons When it rains, it pours I laugh to myself when I change the score You said my sex was a lot, but my brain gave you more uh, And something about how your ex was a toy I guess he played games There's only diamond dice here, not trying to justify But when you shut your eye, you can touch the sky You in trouble, ma, and you should pray about speed But if it's about you, what that say about me? We got some goodies, y'all. We have got some goodies. I just got back in, as you guys can see. Oh, oh hold on. The nails, y'all already saw them, but I love. These are just so cute. I don't do designs very often. Um, typically when I'm going on a trip. And I don't know, this just gives New York to me. Even though I'm going for literally a day, like the set is just cute. It gives spring, but it also gives New York City, so. They ate. And then I just did like um a baby pink on my toes, but it's looking a little lilac. But it's cute, honestly. It looks good. Okay, I actually already know what these are. This is for New York as well. I got some new heels, y'all, from Amazon. It's a reveal. Unboxing. I hope it's cute, guys. Okay. Hold on. This looked pretty good to me. What y'all think? This look pretty good. The heel not too high. I'm a baby, like, sorry. I'm not wearing no six inch anything. I'm so happy that kitten heels aren't trendy because the way that it was never gonna give six inch heel for me, like, ever. But I like these though, cause I don't have like any sandaled heels. Um, I have a dress that I wanna wear this with. So one of the nights in New York, we're gonna be going to dinner and I think this is gonna eat with it. Let's try it on though. I got my toes done now, so. I'm gonna put y'all right here. Let's see. I would never wear it with this outfit, but. Okay. Do we like her? What do we think? I think she's cute. Stormy, what you think? But yeah, this is it guys. Okay. Stormy, excuse me, you're in my shot. <laughs> Hi, girl. Hello, mama. All right, I'm gonna go look in the mirror real quick because I can't really tell from camera. Okay, yeah, that was the heels. Let's open up this. I'm like almost certain I know what this is. This is not even for me, it's for my dog. Okay, yeah. I do want to see what this smell like though. So basically I got her like a fragrance because she be stinking sometimes. Like I'm not gonna lie. I take her to the groomers and they do a good job, but like I take her once a month. So sometimes she's stink in between. And I would like for her to have a cute little fragrance because I love a little fragrance. But I went with something natural. You know, I'm not trying to harm my girl. So I tried this one out. This is a vanilla and almond smell. Ooh, we got a nice little clean scent to it. That smells really good, you guys. Do I dare test it out on her? She gonna scream. She's just enjoying her meal right now. I don't wanna bother her. <laughs> okay, I won't bother her. 
but that's everything I got. We've had a pretty good day, y'all. Um, I'm still working on getting my video up for today. Um, but honestly, I'm almost done editing. I've been like the multitasking queen today. Like literally any moment I had where I was just sitting down, I was editing. So the video is almost done. What the problem is, is that I don't have any good thumbnail pictures. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do then, but I'll worry about that when I get there. day of the vlog as you guys can see i've had a really productive morning i told y'all my girl sarah was sleeping over last night so she did end up coming like late last night and then this morning we were just kind of doing our thing like i had work today so i was just um doing my work period and sarah was doing like some organization she's off today so she was just doing some planning for her week right now actually we about to build this desk that i was telling y'all about Y'all can't really see it. Sarah got the corner set up because she about to get to work and I'm about to try to help her as best as I can. But yeah, literally y'all, I have not been able to build this desk myself. Like I wasn't even going to attempt to, but I'm very blessed and I'm very grateful that um Sarah's gonna attempt to help me out here. So yeah, we're gonna build this. And then after actually we have plans, we've been trying to see this Bob Marley movie for literally weeks. So after we're done building that, we're gonna get ready for the movie. But first, we about to get busy. Sarah built that in like 15 minutes. Book her. Desk reveal. Woo! <laughs> yes! She got drawers. She's fire. And she is thirty. So real simple, y'all. If y'all are interested, this is from Home Depot. Two little drawers. Nothing crazy. But I'm going to turn this into like a vanity slash working space area so i just ordered i was telling sarah i ordered a big mirror from tiktok that's gonna sit on my desk it's circular it's cute it has like led lights y'all will be seeing get ready with me quite soon in this very corner on our way to the movies and if okay y'all be running late for this movie but honestly i predict by the time we get in there it's gonna just be starting so hurry in oh yeah does it order to our seats or no only if you're sitting upstairs in the next level. Yeah, you said that. If your seats are upstairs in the next level, you can order through the app or through the bar, and then if you get delivered to your seat, but down here it's different. Down here it's um, take like take out. Do you guys like <laughs> strawberry? Mm -hmm. Can I put some strawberry on the roof? Mm -hmm. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, that drink looks so good. Yes. Together. So, thank you so thank much. You. <laughs> so good. <laughs> <laughs> to wind down and just wash my face before I go to bed. Let's recap about the movie. Honestly y'all, by the time you guys see this video, the Bob Marley movie been out. It's probably old news at this point, but I really liked it guys. Like, whew. No, honestly, I've heard like mixed reviews like from other people about this movie, like real Jamaicans and like real Bob Marley fans will tell you that. They didn't really capture the movie well and honestly i can get that like i don't really know bob marley's life like that like i'm not gonna sit here and say i'm a diehard fan but even in watching it i'm like oh something feels missing 
Yeah, the ending definitely did feel abrupt. I'm like, wait, oh, it's over? Now, as for me and the rest of my night, it feels much later than what it is. I don't know if it's this daylight savings that's messing me up, y'all, but I'm tired. It don't matter what time I wake up. It don't matter what time I go to bed. Your girl is tired. Like, please. It's not even 10 o'clock. I'm sleepy. <laughs> we were also drinking a little bit of wine, so maybe that's part of the reason why, too, but it's giving bedtime, y'all. I can't wait to hop in this bed. But anyways, I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Trader Joe's just took all my money. But honestly, y'all, um, if you're not hip, Trader Joe's is that grocery store. Every other grocery store, them prices are rising at an astronomical rate. But Trader Joe's has never steered us wrong. So I'm gonna do like a super speed through Trader Joe's grocery haul. If you don't care about this, you should skip through. But we got a lot of stuff. So I'm gonna go through it like really fast. Organic lemons. We got some honey crisp apples. Old fashioned oats, yellow potato, sweet potato, mango nectar juice, apple cider vinegar. We got some on the vine tomatoes, three bags of peanut butter chocolate cup, ground jasmine rice, the biggest bottle of sea salt that you've ever seen in your life. We have that. Five cans of tuna in olive oil to be specific. Penne pasta, sunflower oil, organic ketchup. We got a chicken tiki masala, butternut squash ravioli. We have two Korean style noodles. Oh, I got four of those, oh, baby. Four. <laughs> Excuse me. Another chicken tiki masala. Next, we have this flatbread cheese and tomato pizza. Organic orange juice. Thai green curry frozen dinner. Bananas. Seaweed snacks. Mini plain bagels. Spaghetti. Ezekiel bread. Garlic naan. Oh, just kidding. These are onion pancakes. Brazilian cheese bread. Mini vegetable samosas. Whole grain waffles. Turkey bacon. Bell peppers. Tomato soup. Irish butter. Two packs of ground turkey. This is the best vodka sauce in the world, y'all. Wegmans. Two bottles of it. All right, I got a couple bags of popcorn. There's a lot of commotion going on in the kitchen, y'all. Sorry about that. Hash browns. Cashews. We got some honey. And last but not least, more potatoes. I hope you guys enjoyed that little Trader Joe's haul. I hope that inspired y'all. I hope it put you on to some new things at Trader Joe's. And um, I'm about to get cooking, so I may or may not record that. I'm honestly <laughs> hungry. I just want to get right on into the meal, so uh, I'll see y'all later. It's better day. <laughs> no, it's actually better day. Like, please, I'm turning the camera off. <laughs> home improvement I basically ordered a mirror for my desk things are coming together in my room I'm so happy about it and I literally ordered this from TikTok shop this had 10 like 10 purchases like nobody has bought this nobody has reviewed this <laughs> 
So I hope I did not get scammed, but let's unbox this, y'all. Bro, this is how you know I'm getting older because I'm like, this kind of stuff is starting to excite me more than clothes. Like, my decorating my space, having new furniture, like, is really such a pleasant gift to myself. I hike you need to buy an extension cord because, like, this outlet behind my bed, like, it ain't cutting it. I need more ports. But for the purposes of showing y'all and also showing my damn self, let's just plug this in real quick. Okay. This is cute, y'all. Oh, y'all are about to see me. Y'all are about to see me, like, yeah. If you guys do want this specific mirror, I will link it down below. I got it 24 by 24 inches. I almost went a size smaller than that, so I'm happy I didn't because this is perfect size for this desk size. I think I got it for, like, maybe, like, $70, which is so good, bro, because I've been seeing these for, like, 100 and up, and I just wasn't trying to pay that. So connected to 